The sophomores are stepping trackside here for the 32nd running of the DRF Bets Rushaway. $75,000 stake event to go a mile and 16th. Here is the field. Number one, Kentucky All-Star. Owned by the Calumet Farm. Trained by Mike Meeker with Rodney Prescott. Number two, Alberio. Owned by Ronald Kales and Hugo Andrade. Ronald Kales trains in Sammy Bermudas in the tack. The three is uh, Bundi Bunan, owned by the Haras Interlagos, trained by Ignacio Correas with Declan Cannon. Number four carries the silks of the Qatar Racing. Mark Cassie trains its federal law, Gary Boulanger, in town to ride. Number five, the local horse Overprotective. Owned, trained, and bred by Keith Kinman, Luan Machado, the jockey. Number six is Faraway Kitten, owned by Kenneth and Sarah Ramsey, trained by Mike Maker and Tyler Gaffleone, the jockey. The seven is Kitchy, owned by the Shelter Wee Farm of Michael Evans in partnership with the Virginia Tara Trust. Michael Evans, the second, trains in Rolly Aragon. We'll handle the writing assignment. The eight is the favorite on the way to Neverland, owned by Dave Reed's Ice Wine Stable, Wesley Ward, the conditioner, and Rafael Bejarano, the jockey. And to the outside is Magdalena Racing and River Ranch Racing's King Ford. He's trained by Kenny McPeak, and Brian Hernandez Jr. will wear those orange silks. That's the nine of them for the 30-second running of the DRF Bets Rush Away. This does start a all-stakes pick four. And they are off in the DRF Bets Rush Away stakes. And it was the favorite on the way to Neverland who will get the first call as they run by us for the first time. Federal Law away in the second position. Up on the outside advancing now comes King Ford and Akichi. They're well bunched on the run the first turn. Where the favorite just narrowly leads. On the way to Neverland leads, but now there goes a Kitchy, the big long shot, who forces his hand up to the outside. Three wide, Orange Silks comes King Ford. Far away, Kitten is fourth. Kentucky All-Star in a tough and tight spot just had to check as overprotective advances up to the outside. Then comes a Bundi Bunan in six links last to Alberio. The quarter was 24 and two, and they run up the backside, and the tearaway leader, the big long shot, Kitchy, he's bumped the lead to just about three on the way to Neverland, and Bayerano content to track from second. King Ford and Brian Hernandez out in the clear from third. Federal Law advances to the inside of Faraway Kitten. Then a link for the back now, Bundy Bunan starts to roll up to the outside overprotective, is in with a shot, and two links back to Kentucky All-Star, and another seven or eight still to Alberio. The half mile curved out in 48 and two. It's Kitchy shows the way, but on the way to Neverland, tugging hard against Bayerano. He's sitting idling there, but as Faraway Kitten comes to tackle to the outside. So Tyler G cuts loose Faraway Kitten to the outside as they race around the turn, approach of the quarter mile pole in the rush away. And it's on the way to Neverland, confronted by Faraway Kitten, and these two are shoulder to shoulder as they turn on down for the judges. On the way to Neverland with the lead. It's Faraway Kitten trying to press pass down to the inside. Here comes long shot Boondi Bunan down the center, is overprotective, but with the a 16th of a mile left to go on the way to Neverland is on the way to the winner's circle on the way to Neverland impressive draws away in the DRF bets rush away wins wrapped up late by almost five in the end Boondi Bunan ran a game one for second far away kit in third overprotective in a photo for fourth in 145 and two